So I got a question this morning about what type of chemicals we use to clean roofs with. And I'll cover that at the end here. But first I wanna go through just a couple different methods of cleaning roofs. So first, the way I first started out was literally just scrubbing the moss off the roofs. The reason that we don't do that anymore is because the more pressure and, and friction you put on a roof, the more damage you can potentially cause. You can do it kind of safely, but it's generally good if you just kill that moss and let it come off the roof kind of naturally. So because of that, we only soft wash roofs now. There's a number of different chemicals that you can start out with. Some people will use, like if you go to the pool section in Walmart, you can find their uh, pool shock bleach. It's generally about a 10% bleach. That'll work. You can put that in a pump up sprayer. You can create a little pump system for yourself and you can dilute that down to about five to six percent and put that on your roof that'll take care of all the moss mildew mold algae all that growth and then you let mother nature kind of just wash that off dry it out with the sun wash it off with rain and it'll take care of itself another product that is out there right now is called cleans o2 and that is a peroxide base and it's a binary product so again you have to do some mixing but that is a little bit softer on plant life and animals. You don't have to do as much dilution of it. So I'm heard, I haven't used it yet, but I do hear of a lot of people that like to use that. Now finally, the, the industry standard for roof washing is sodium hypochlorite. Sodium hypochlorite is just the industrial word for what you know as bleach. I get mine and most of the pros get theirs in about a 12.5% mix and you get those from chemical companies. I, bull, I buy mine in 55 gallon drums. You can go get them in like 250 gallon drums. You can get them in five gallon drums. The difference in, in how much you buy at a time is, is going to be probably significant for you on price. Uh, I believe at a five gallon drum, it costs close to $10 a gallon up here in Washington state. Uh, how I buy it in a 55 gallon drum, it costs me about $5. And then if I were to go up to 250 gallons, it, it would give me a little bit more savings. But essentially we're using sodium hypochlorite. Then we dilute that down to the strength that's necessary for the job that we're doing. So on one of my more recent shorts, I was washing a roof and I washed that roof at about 4%. The general roof washing percentage is between five and 6% but there's some reasons why you might lower or, or raise that, why you might use a weaker or stronger mix on it, which I'm not gonna get into in this video. But just know that the pros use super hy sodium hypochlorite. There are options out there. You can use bleach or you can use peroxide base. And in anybody that's uh, in, in the industry that sees this video, go ahead and leave a comment down below if you use something different. I know there are multiple options out there, but sodium hypochlorite is the standard for now across the united states hopefully that's helpful uh, leave me some comments if you have any questions about that product or if you use something differently so that we can all learn from you and i hope to see you guys soon like and subscribe thanks